okay hopefully by now you should be able to um to distinguish between a fraction and a non-fraction so over here is 7 over 8 meter this is not a fraction so not a fraction not ah uh. but then this one is a fraction 1 over 8 is a fraction so we take step by step uh. we take this whole thing is what is 7 over 8 7 over 8 meter of cloth okay and cut out three pieces of the same length okay each piece will be one eight he had how much cloth he left so that means he has left something and then okay let me just anyhow do something this is what i consider as left so that means he didn't cut this all into three pieces he cut out some length into three pieces so here i cut one must be of an equal length and this equal length is what each piece like one piece here like that right is one eighth of the cloth so one eighth of the cloth the cloth is how many centimeter and how many meter one eighth of the cloth the cloth is what seven over eight meter so is what so how much cloth did he have left so uh it's one eight right he cut seven over eight that's one eight because one eight of seven over eight meter right so it's seven over sixty four so one of these are uh, is one eight of of the above value or not so in fact he has what has three three of these so seven over sixty four times three will give me twenty one over sixty four okay meter because here is meter already because one eight of seven over eight meter equals to seven over sixty four meter okay so this is also meter and this meter so what 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 does that mean that means ah uh, this whole thing here what do I mean ah uh? this whole thing here is actually twenty one over sixty four meter so I'm asking you how much left okay how much left the one left is actually we take seven over eight minus twenty one over sixty four this is what is left and if you were to do the calculation right you will have an answer of thirty five over sixty four meter so you have thirty five over sixty four meter how many more such pieces can he cut from it how many more such pieces wait now okay so now you know that this portion here this portion here is actually thirty five over sixty four correct or not so how many more such pieces can you cut from it okay then let me draw this this whole bar is 64 already 64 okay this one is 21 unit and this one is 35 unit correct i know that one eight of it now uh, one eight of it is this portion here is 7 over 64 so when 60 i, I still left with uh 35 right so if one unit one of these are is seven this is seven unit so 35 divided by seven will give me how many you can cut five five more pieces out of it five more pieces okay Okay, after Aston has sold his share of his ticket, Vara sold 2 over 7 of the remainder. So I know that here is E, right? Correct? Then, it says he has sold some, I don't know he sold how many, so I just draw here. Okay? Give me a minute now. 
Okay, then over here, right? It says uh, this total over the of the remaining. Of the remaining, I told you before, you always draw this so you have a clearer, clear idea. So this portion here is what a fraction. Fraction of what? Of the one above. So I cut into seven parts. Okay, so over here is by Farah, 2 over 7. And then the remaining is what, by who? 5 over 7 is by this guy here. And then it says that if E and F, so if plus F equals to 165, okay. And then G and E is equals to 246. Okay, very good. For here, right, we can clearly do some rearrangement because we can see over here very clearly that E and E is the same. So can we do something like that? If I were to draw uh, E over here and this portion is G, this whole thing here is 2, 4, 6 is G, huh? and E is here, this portion here, E and F is smaller, right? F is here. Always look for the things that is the same so you can do some connection. Okay? So, I, 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 <coughs> okay, I can clearly see that F is how many unit? F is 2 unit. Here is actually two unit. If here is two unit, that means here is also two unit. And you know the whole thing G here right is five units. Correct? Whole thing here is five units. So here is clearly three units. Then what is here? Here is very simple. We have 2, 4, 6 minus 165 will give you 81. So, you got this wrong again. Okay? You look further. So, if in this case, 3 units will be equals to 81, then obviously, it's not asking you how much did this person sell. So, if 3 units equals to 81, one unit will be equals to 81 divided by 3. Correct? You can do this. 81 divided by 3. It's 27. And then, this guy here have 5, five units. Have 5 units. So, times 5. It's one three. It's one actually one three five tickets. Okay, that's all for this.